you know, I think my class should really be reading some Jane Austen. I mean, she's the best author of all time. Okay, calm down, Kanye. Don't you think Austen's a bit advanced for third graders? Well, do not compare me to Kanye West. He's a dick. Okay, Kanye may be a dick, but he was right. Okay, Ari? Kanye was right. Yonce is a national motherfucking treasure. Okay? Okay. Okay, don't fucking talk shit about Yonce like that. I, I didn't. Mm. Who's that? My friend Shelby. We're supposed to meet up and play music in a little bit. Oh, she plays? Yeah, and she sings. Oh. You know, I've always wanted to take singing lessons. I've always imagined myself as a real-life princess. You know, singing with the birds, living in the woods, having little dwarves. Yeah, she's a really good singer. I bet she is. Is she, um, seeing anyone? Yeah, she gives lessons a couple times a week. I could probably have her hit you up and you guys can work something out. Yeah, I could use some lessons from her. I think her 6 p.m. on Thursday canceled if you guys want to meet up then and talk it out or something. Yeah, talk it out. Yeah, talk it out. Yeah. Okay, well, I'm gonna go. I bet you have an amazing voice. I've always wanted to take singing lessons. I mean, I've always imagined myself. Uh, yeah, Travis told me, uh, <laughs> birds and princess. So I usually charge about $40 uh, a week. You know, Travis didn't tell me you were so pretty. Thank you. I guess it's not a part of the job description. <laughs> so where do you see yourself in a few years? With singing? Probably nowhere, really. Do you want a family? Kids? I mean, I'm all for adoption. I've always wanted one of my own, but I always say, why make a new one when there are so many perfectly good used ones out there? Sure. I don't really like kids, so I try to stay away from them. They're little leeches that suck the life out of everything. And I don't believe in marriage. <laughs> Me neither. I mean, the man is always trying to oppress us with his institution of marriage and regulating our bodies. I'm not going to be a housewife. Uh-huh. Uh, anyway, I give lessons two times a week in the evenings because I work during the day. But I'm totally flexible. <laughs> I bet you are. But, yeah, I mean, I can be most of the time. I've got this. Thanks. That's really nice of you. You know, I've had a really good time. We should do this again sometime. Uh, yeah. Lessons. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna say it. Can I take you on another date? in general. What'd you tell her? I need the money. I said I would see her next week. You're going to hell. So are you. Bitch, I'm driving the motherfucking van pool to hell. Well, I guess I'm gay now, so it doesn't really matter. Are you? Woman was mad. Where you work, she yelled. I said I asked you where you work. Stupid question. There's a logo on my cert. I said she went berserk. Said, need to look at your bike. I am me constant. Didn't move or say shit. She walked up seeking guilt. Triumphantly, she goes, my husband's bike was stolen last night. Somebody snuck into our yard and pulled it out from the side. And now he don't got a ride. You probably know it. A black cruiser with a basket. Simple lights in the side. And as she motions to my bicycle, I capture the picture. Holy shit, she's really claiming I'm the thief that had lifted his bike. It's my completely...